Three, two, one, hit it. Hi folks, Jesse here from JP Modified. Finally, I'm back after a month. Um, it's been really tough to handle or time manage the uh, situation uh, between my modding and my editing because um, as some of you know, my girlfriend is the one that takes care of, uh, you know, shooting and editing while I work on the mods. She kind of has a different schedule now and uh, her schedule doesn't kind of meet with mine. It's a little tough, but here I am back again with another build video. Now, this build is another client build. Uh, much like the previous video I had with Mean Panda. The client wanted to get back to gaming and wanted to reuse a computer that he's kind of leaving alone. He asked me to mod his computer so he could have something pretty to game with once again. So the PC arrived as expected uh, with a lot of dust. It also had uh, some other parts blocking the air filters and it was kind of pretty hard for me to take a better visual on my plans. So I tore down the case and got the ball rolling. So I started by scuffing the surface and prepping it for paint. For this project, I used Krylon. While the other parts I painted was drying, I cut an opening at the front of the Fantex case. Now, if any of you want to ask why I didn't do the design straight onto the front of the case, I wanted to have a little bit of freedom in what I wanted to do. Now, if I didn't like the design, there would be no turning back. By just leaving an opening and putting acrylic over it, it gives me a little room for error. After painting the front panel design, I proceeded to cut out the cover or the overlay for the PSU bay. I then moved on to designing the uh, cover for the PSU. 
put it on top of the PSU after the paint dried and put it in the case for the meantime so I can see the end result. Put in some LEDs in the side. Let there be light. I wanted to have a glowing logo on the front of the case as well, so this is something I haven't tried before. Replaced the power logo with something a little bit more modified. Now moving forward to the trickiest part of the mod. Now the client had an H100i that he wanted me to keep on the build. I decided to mod that by replacing the tubes and the logo on it. Now I know some of you will comment that this is not advisable, you're not supposed to do it with an AIO and stuff, but uh, trust me, this is not the first time I've done this before. I've had several projects uh, years ago that um, still use you know, the coolers that I've modded and uh, did not affect the temps, the performance or anything. And right now they're still running, so I'm sure it didn't affect the longevity of the product itself either. I'll do a separate video on how to do that once I get my hands on another AIO.
So there you have it, Project Sentinel. I just wanted to show you guys what it would take to mod, you know, how simple modifications can take your rig to places. Within a few hours after I released Project Sentinel, a uh, website owner already contacted me and asked if we could do a feature on the, uh, the project. I'll include the link to that uh, website um, down below in the description. So, like I said, you really, really don't need to, you know, have special tools or huge amounts of uh, equipment to, you know, to get started yourself in modding. So, I encourage everyone to get started. Um, either be just a couple of uh, acrylic panels or stickers or whatever, you know, just customize your rig according to you. Make your rig your own. And if you don't have the talent to do that or if you don't have the time, that's where you know people like me come in. I have a few videos that uh, I've yet to release, and I still need to you know finish the edits on that. I will be releasing that soon. Moving forward, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please do stay subbed. If you haven't subbed, give me a sub. Uh, looking forward to making more videos and um, interacting with you guys. Uh, I do have a Twitter account now. I have no idea how to use Twitter, but I'm there. Again, thank you. Jesse here from JP Modified. See you on the next video.